everyone. Okay. Today is another beautiful day. We didn't get to film yesterday because the weather. It was uh, not being cooperative. But what was crazy was it was on my way to school I, I had to take my truck and it was kind of like clouds were over there and clouds were behind me but over me was clear and so I made the decision to not take a chance and um, You know, because I've been in that situation before where I took a chance and um, ended up that I was wrong in my judgment and ended up soaking wet on my way to school. So I spent uh, like an hour and 20 minutes in class soaked. And uh, that wasn't fun because the teacher in that class thought it was a North Pole contest. You know, it was freezing. So anyway, um, yeah, so I was like, okay, you know what? I learned my lesson. I'm not going to do it this time. And it sucked because I could have taken it that time. It was, I mean, don't get me wrong, I, I was sure it was gonna rain. I mean, it was dark clouds on both sides of the island and just over me was clear. And so I knew I would have made it to school unscathed, but I was worried about on the way home, you know? That was still sucked. Anytime you ride in the rain, it's not that fun. Especially when you have all your school stuff in the back. So anyway, yeah, that's what happened. So we couldn't, couldn't do a video yesterday. You know, I really look forward to these rides. I, before and, before class, I don't really have that much time to, you know, just hop on the bike and do whatever. I have a lot of other stuff to take care of. So, uh, trust me, I wish I could. <clears throat> so I look forward to these moments where, you know, I'm, I'm kind of fortunate enough to be able to do what I like to do right before I have to go to something that I don't really want to do all the time but I kind of have to do so there's a silver lining catch 22 is the weather has to be good so in the summer months sort of uh, fall like August, September, October it's not that great because it's raining most of the time so a lot of times I'm stuck taking the truck if that guy flashed me because he knew me or because there's someone sitting up here waiting to get me never know so we'll just play it safe I'm kind of late for school right now it's uh about the time I'm supposed to actually be walking in the class 
but had some stuff to take care of. Like putting the kickstand back on the bike. For some reason or another, uh, the kickstand bolt snapped. And so I found my bike laying on the ground. Lucky um, I didn't find it too late, otherwise all the gas would have spilled out of it. But nevertheless, found the bike on the ground. And I was like, what the hell happened? So I look at the kickstand bolt and they just snapped off. So what I did was I went and grabbed a grade 8 bolt and uh, put them in shoulder bolt so hopefully this one holds up better I don't know exactly uh, what the stock bolt was but this bike is about nine years old now so I don't really blame a nine-year-old bolt it's been doing the job for nine years you know did it good can't complain oh man what's this wet spot here at least I'm getting out of it for the other cars come to get me so I had to get all that situated now we're finally on the bike heading heading the class So I got a couple questions um, over the week. Kind of uh, questions from you guys off island about Guam, a little bit about Guam. Um, the best thing you can do is first look it up. Okay. Um, for those of you who've never heard of Guam, we're at US territory. And, and also watch some of my other videos because I, I go into a little bit of um, history uh, on our island and you know culture a little bit and uh, I'm going to be putting out a series of videos that mainly uh, are focused on that about the culture and you know different aspects of the culture so stay tuned for that I will be getting those out real soon uh, for now like I said, I'm, I apologize, but the only time I really have is right now, God, that sun is just straight in my eyeball. Anyway, the only time I have right now to film really is on my way to school. And uh, don't worry, I'm, I'm making things happen to change that around, okay? So just stay patient. And we'll get there so again my advice look it up online there's a lot of online resources also um, you could watch videos uh, there's quite a few YouTube videos already out there besides mine I encourage you to watch all of them um, I believe there's even a, a couple of them from people who are stationed here who are in the military it's good to get their point of view also because it's kind of like outside looking in kind of point of view. My point of view is more of an inside, you know, insider's point of view because I've, I'm, I'm born and raised here, you know. I, 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 mean, I ain't gonna lie, I'm kind of biased towards this island. I love this island and what's good is a lot of other people do too. Um, a lot of my buddies are in the military stationed here for a few years. Um, one of my friends, in fact, is, is visiting right now. He was stationed here a few years ago. And he got married to a local. And, uh, so now they're back to visit. And, you know, I, I, I met him. It was funny because I met him when he first got stationed here. And so we hung out for the... Two and a half years, I believe, that he was here. Three might might have been. 
but uh, he ended up falling in love with the island, falling in love with an island girl, and you know now he he kind of has island roots, and that's a. Uh, I ain't gonna lie, it's not a thousand percent all good, but it's more good than it is bad. I mean, more than you can say for most places, right? So anyway, um, again, we'll get more into depth in, uh, in future videos. So please keep watching, please subscribe, and please let me be your vehicle to get this content out for you. And uh, one way to get what you're, you're asking for is please add comments. Um, you can message me, email me, uh, esquam at gmail.com. And, I, and I'll take care of you guys. Anyway, we're almost to class. So I'm going to sign out now. Thanks again. Once again, peace out.